Hello friends, in this video we are going to discuss essay 1 model core paper for class 7 subject mathematics. Section 1 answer the following question. Solve 3x plus 8 is equal to 5x plus 2. In math solve means you have to find the variable x can call it. If you want to solve it, you have to find the variable we have to find students. In the variable is x. So our aim is to find x value in this problem. So 3x plus 8 is equal to 5x plus 2 will bring all x together and numbers together. So, so let us take the number left side 8 as it is. Plus 2 moves to this side will become minus 2. And I am keeping 5x right hand side as it is. And plus 3x goes to the other side will become minus 3x. So 8 minus 2 is 6. 5x minus 3x both are like terms. 5x load into 3x this side we will get 2x. As we want x, we will send this 2 to other side. We all know that when multiplication 2 and x relation is multiplication. Multiplication each side is division. So 6 divided by 2 is nothing but 3. So value of x for first question is 3. Moving on to the second question. Evaluate 0 0.3 into 0 0.2. So 0 0.3 ni 0 0.2 ni multiply chayali. So before multiplying uh, decimal numbers, we have to keep one thing in mind students. Man, we have to keep 3 and 2 ne this called decimal part ne skip chesi. This without decimal part ne man multiply chayal first. 0 0.3 and 3 ka this called 0 0.2 is a decimal number and 2 is a integer. 3 2 is a 6. Kada mota many decimal places sunen students. 0 0.3 and 1 decimal place. 0 0.2 and 1 decimal place. So we have to Keep this number in such a way we have to get two decimal numbers. So one, one. Here one decimal place on the here one decimal place on the kaabati. Two decimal places are chatted to six nine. So 0 0.006 is the value for 0 0.3 into 0 0.2. Moving on to the third question. Radhika says two acute angles cannot form a pair of supplementary angles. Do you agree? Give reason. Supplementary angles under students 180 degrees. Two angles ne kalpute. Any two angles you should get the sum as 180 degrees. So eda ne two rondo angles ne kalpute 180 osse. Then is supplementary angles under mana. So two acute angles kalpute. Adi supplementary angle outunda le da na the question. Do you agree? No. We should we can't agree because each angle in acute angle is less than 90. Acute angle ante man under kudelso. Less than 90 degrees onto the gavate. So less than 90 degrees also we cannot make the angle as 180. So it cannot be a supplementary angle. Fourth question: Using pencil and ruler, draw the following take, taking appropriate angle of your choice. So accurate aim most of the students manam acute angle acute angle appropriate ka draw chale. So this is acute angle which is less than 90 degrees. 90 degrees kante taku unde the acute angle. Acute angle ante Greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees unde dhani manam acute angle atam. This is the rough measurements taken to find acute angle and acute angle. Fifth question. Give two example of adjacent angles in your daily life. So we will see many things in our daily life adjacent angle. For example, steering wheel of the car is, have adjacent angles. The three hands of the clock will also have adjacent angles. Represent minus 4 plus minus 5 on number line. Okay. Minus 4 plus minus 5. So minus 4 where it lies? It lies here. Am I right? I will just change the pencil color now to blue. So minus 4 will be the left side of 0 here. Okay. This is minus 4. And we have to add with minus 5. So minus 5 and the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Left side this scalar in the kind of minus 5 is a negative number. So minus 4 plus minus 5 is nothing but minus 9 students. So minus 4 plus minus 5 is nothing but minus 9. Last question in this section. Seventh one. Write the type of triangle according to their sides. So according to the sides of a triangle, it is divided into three triangles. One is scale and triangle, isosceles triangle, equilateral triangle. Scale and triangles and students, any sides unequal, 
isosceles triangle लो two sides equal उन्टाई, ये दन्न two sides same उन्टाई नमाँ, equilateral triangle लो अन्नि sides same उन्टाई, section 2 discuss जेद्धम students, 8th question, find the value of x and y from the figure, so मनम, we have to find x and y angles in the given figure students, so we all know that exterior angle is equal to sum of opposite interior angles, so exterior angle इकड़े एंटी 120 degrees is equal to sum of opposite interior angles, इकड़े interior angles एंट students 50 and x, they are interior opposite angles to 120, so मनमो 120 is equal to 50 plus x is it as per the formula of exterior angle, so x मनकी 120 minus 50 हो सदी, इंदु कट्ट plus 50 इट साइड होते minus 50 हो सदी, so 120 minus 50 is nothing but 70, so we got the value of x as 70, so उक्क वेल x 70 आइते y एंथो उन्टों स्टुएंस, we know the sum of 3 angles in a triangle is 180 degrees, इंटे 70 plus 50 plus y, so इए angle we know that 70 degrees, 50 degrees y, sum of 3 angles in a triangle is 180 degrees, we all know that, 70 plus 50 is 120, 120 plus y is 180, so as we want y, so when we will send plus 120 to other side, it will become 60 degrees, so 180 minus 120 is 60, so the value of x is 70 and y is 60 students. Ninth question, arrange 5 by 8, 5 by 6, 1 by 2 in ascending order. So, 5 by 8 decimal fraction लेला चाहिए चाहिए 0.625, 5 by 6 चाहिए 0.833, 1 by 2 चाहिए off which is nothing but 0.5. We all know that 0.5 is less, 0.625 is the next less number and 0.3 is the biggest number. So, ascending order लेला पड़ता हमों 1 by 2, 5 by 8 and 5 by 6. Tenth one. Verify 18 into 7 plus minus 3 is equal to 18 into 7 plus 18 into minus 3. Students verify and the maths law LHS, RHS same and prove chayet and verify and the So, manu first LHS this kundamu e value we will get one answer. RHS this kundamu ok answer us kundi. Ar one answer equal and prove chayet and manu question ok laksham means that is what we have to prove in this problem so we'll take lhs lhs and 18 into 7 plus minus 3 so first always we have to do bracket part bracket part lay mundi 7 plus minus 3 so 7 minus 3 and the students 4 so 18 into 4 is 72 so manaki left hand side and touch in the value 72 so we'll take rhs now rhs a mundi 18 into 7 plus 18 into minus 3 we all know that 18 7s are 126, 18 into minus 3 is minus 54, 126 loan into 54 both is 72, LHS 72 hoch in the RHS 72 hoch in the. so LHS and RHS are same, therefore we verified that 18 into 7 plus of minus 3 is same as 18 into 7 plus 18 into minus 3. Moving on to the 11th question, total number of boys and girls in a class is 52. Boys x and kunnamu, girls x plus 10 chindi, which is 52. Yes. So x plus x plus 10 is 52. x plus x mana under the like terms 2x plus 10 is equal to 52. So we should not take this one as 12x students because 2x and 10 are not like terms. This is variable, this is number. Variable number ni epudu add chayadu. So alage petale. 2x plus 10 is 52 so manaku x kaaval ga batti first manam 10 at side pampiddam students 2x is equal to 52 minus 10 so 52 lo nunchi 10 pothe man andar telsu 42 so 52 minus 10 is 42 as we want x we will send this 2 also multiplication to other side which will become division 42 by 2 is 21 so x manam em anukunnamu boys 21 x manamu boys anukunnam guys students so manam number of boys in class is 21 and number of girls in the mandi boys can take on our girls so 10 students are more than boys so 21 plus 10 which is nothing but 31 three angles of a triangle are in the ratio 1 is to 2 is to 3 find the angles so 1 is to 2 is to 3 angle ratio each other manam each angle can call a triangle so so manam each angle can call it ratio each other ga batte e 1 ni x and kundamu e ratio 2 ni 2x and kundamu the other ratio 3 ni 3x anukundam 1 is to 2 is to 3 can be represented as x 
2x 3x so we all know that sum of three angles in a triangle is 180 degrees so e three angles ne add jadam x plus 2x plus 3x enta 6x 6x is 180 manaku x kavali kabatti multiplication akkada poyindi kabatti division 180 by 6 is nothing but 30 degrees so x value 30 vachindi students so first angle is 30 second angle em anukunnamo 2x anukunnamo ante x 30 vachindi kabatti 2 into 30 is 60 degrees so second angle is 60 degrees third angle we have assumed as 3x so 3x is nothing but 3 into 30 which is nothing but 90 degrees so third angle 90 so the three angles are 30 degrees 60 degrees and 90 degrees we'll discuss section 3 now 14 question sum of three consecutive integers is 33 find all the integers so consecutive integers ante ento we will understand first Consecutive ante okati tarvata okati achay number. For example, 4 and 5 are consecutive numbers. 10 and 11 are consecutive numbers. So, immediately next number or next integer we call it as consecutive integer. So, manaki 3 consecutive integers kawal gabate, manaki telidu kawate integer ne will take it as x. So, x ki next number ante x plus 1 which is consecutive number. x plus 1 ki next number will be x plus 2. So, the three consecutive integers are x, x plus 1, x plus 2. This is very important students. Once you know this, next part of the problem will be very easy. So, this sum ante int mass low addition. Sum ante addition gavati x first number, x plus 1 second number, x plus 2 third number. We are not change just to add just to Why we are adding? In the question it is clearly mentioned as sum. Sum ante mass low addition. Which is given as 33. If we add yes, 33 and a condition question which total number of x's are 3x, x plus x plus x. Total 3x's are there. 1 plus 2 are the only numbers, so which is nothing but 3. So 3x plus 3, which is nothing but 33. So 3x is equal to 33 minus 3, which is nothing but 30. So 3x is equal to 30. 33 minus 3 is 30 x we want which is nothing but 30 by 3 which is nothing but 10. So, manik oka sir x so chindi ga abatti 10 value. The next three consecutive integers will be obviously 10, 11, 12. So, the three consecutive integers are 10, 11. 15th question. The temperature of four city of Telangana on a particular day are shown on the number line. So, first this is the number line and the temperature of four cities in Telangana is given. So, write the temperature of cities marked on it. So, minus 20 degrees is the temperature for Varangal. Minus 16 degrees is the temperature for Nijamabad. 10 degrees is the temperature plus 10 degrees centigrade is the temperature for Hyderabad. And 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 degrees centigrade is the temperature of Suryapet. So, which city has the lowest temperature? Lowest temperature A city on the ante. Minus 20 degrees is the lowest temperature and the city name is Varangal. So, Varangal lo lowest temperature on the and the temperature is minus 20 degrees centigrade. Negative temperature on the students are chala chaliga on the positive on the other chala endaga on the Visit as the highest temperature. Obviously, Surya Pet is having the highest temperature. Name the city with temperature more than 0 degrees. 0 kante equivalent city temperature a cities low on the and Ruthunar Gavati. Obviously, answer will be Hyderabad and Surya Pet. Hyderabad and Surya Pet having the temperature more than 0 degrees centigrade. 16th question Multiply a number by 5 and add 8. It gives 28. Find the number. We don't know the number. Let us take the number as x to s. Manaku match lo edhe te le ledo dhani x to represent jesam. So, according to the problem, multiply a number by 5. So, 5 multiply jayal ga, but a number multiply ga, but we assumed as x, 5x, add 8, addition and a plus symbol, gives 28 is equal to 28. So, this is a linear equation. So, 5x plus 8 is equal to 28. We have to find x here. First, we will send 8 to that side. 5x is equal to 28 minus 8, which is nothing but 20. x is equal to 20 by 5, which is nothing but 4. In the following figure, L and M are interse uh, intersected by a transversal N. If L is parallel to M, find all other angles. So, here Q is given as 100 degrees. 
you all know that q and y are corresponding angles in parallel lines corresponding angles will be equal corresponding angles are q y p x s w r z are corresponding angles friends if q is 100 obviously y will be 100 so i will write y value as sorry y angle as 100 degrees if y is 100 okay if y is 100 obviously w will also be 100 the reason are y and w are opposite angles vertical opposite angles we know that they are equal so y 100 w would 100 out of students and i just now i told w and s are corresponding angles w 100 would s angle would 100 would so we got four angles here we'll see p angle now so q and p are adjacent angles we know sum of adjacent two angles will be 180 degrees so 100 unta p will be obviously 80 so 100 plus 80 will be 180 linear pair random students adjacent angle sum of two adjacent angles will be always be 180 then in mathematics law linear pair random matter <clears throat> so if p is 80 obviously x is also 80 i will write x as 80 if x is 80 z will also be 80 reason is they are vertically opposite angles z is also 80 if z is 80 r will also be 80 they are corresponding angles so y is given as 100 w 100 yes 100 p is 80 because linear pair this is linear pair i will write lp which is nothing but linear pair if p is 80 x is 80 x is 80 z also 80 vertical opposite angles z is 80 obviously r will also be 80 because they are corresponding angles so we got all the angles we'll see part b acute angle in the following question 35 degrees acute angle at 90 degrees kanta takkundi kabatti it is acute angle option a is correct a plus b is equal to b plus a is a commutative property value of 4 by 9 divided by 4 by 5 so 4 by 9 we have to take division as multiplication and the reciprocal of 4 by 5 should be represented as 5 by 4 so 4 4 get cancelled what is remaining students 4 5 ones are 5 9 ones are 9 so answer is b 5 by 9 0 0.5 is also can be written as 5 by 10 the result is 5 so result is 5 and is equal to 5 and minus 8 least number is minus 8 students negative number low is number always a least number so many students think it is 1 1 is the least number no it is wrong negative is number will always be the least number eighth question 36.8 into 1000 is 36800 option c 2 plus 3 by 4 will be 11 by 4 in the adjacent figure the relation between x and y so this is the figure the relation between x and y will always be equal to 180 degrees because x plus y they are adjacent angles form linear pair so x plus y should be equal to 180 degrees 